My big sister is here. Minister Eva Green.
When we come to church, we do not come to church being phony. And we do not come to church to see how big the mother's hats look. We do not come to church to see how bright our weeds are. We do not come to church to see how many family members we have that we can count. We do not come to church to pray for everybody in the world except looking to the Lord to watch over the worship service. We do not come to church for form or fashion. We do not come to church for entertainment. We do not come to church for drama. We do not come to church for mess. We do not come to church to stick gums on the back of the people. We do not come to church to whisper and to gossip with one another. We do not come to church to text and to Facebook. We do not come to church to tweet and to do all kinds of worldly things. But we come into this house gathered in his name to worship him. You do not worship Pastor Turner. Because Pastor Turner makes mistakes. You do not worship Deacon Eric Stovall. Because Deacon Stovall makes mistakes. You do not worship as slick as Deacon Norris's hair is every Sunday morning. We do not come here to worship Deacon Norris. That make no difference how well you're dressed or how high your heels may be. We do not come to worship to paint our fingernails. They should have been painted when you walked in here. We do not come to church for no kind of non... See, all of us in here have done something back in our day. And some of us as Christians are still slipping every now and again. But when we come into the house of the Lord, we come to give God worship. Now, worship is a human response. Amen? It, it, it's a human response to perceive, to the perceived presence of the divine. My brothers and sisters, the Holy Ghost met you when you came in here. He was here. He's here now. The sisters means to stop. Worship means to look up. Worship means to yield. It means to pause for a minute. Worship means to think. Somebody say think. Some of us don't think for nothing. We run our miles before we think. We say things before we think. We do things before we think. But worship, you need to meditate on the Lord. Blessed is the man that walketh not in the counsel of the ungodly, nor standeth in the way of sinners, nor sitteth in the seat of the scornful, but, 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 his delight is where? In the law of the Lord. And in his law, what does he do? Meditate. And how much? meditating on the Lord day and night. See, our schedules get so packed up until we don't have time to worship God. 
Let me tell you something, my brothers and sisters. You don't have to wait until Sunday morning. You can worship God in the kitchen. I only got my two or three hand claps to make y'all know about worshiping God in the kitchen. If you look in the cupboards and you see food in there, you ought to tell God thank you. If you got the refrigerator full of pop and juice and, and, and all kinds of leftovers, you ought to tell God thank you. Because there's somebody out there who's less fortunate than you are. And every day you wake up with a roof over your head, whether if you're paying rent or whether if you're paying a mortgage, you ought to tell God thank you. But stop and think first and look over your life and look and see that God has been good to you. Amen. You don't come in here frowned up and all stained 
us. Yeah. Everybody here got God as their daddy. Yeah. When you find yourself saying to your girlfriend or your boyfriend, I ain't got no money. You need to pinch yourself. And especially if you're saved. You need to reroute that statement. I got money. It's just not in my pocket. All I got to do is just ask my daddy for it. Amen. Amen. If you have to believe that God will supply your every need. Yeah. My God yeah. shall supply all of your needs according to his riches in glory by Christ Jesus. For the Lord is a great God, the great King of all.
want Minister Davis to say hello to us. And I want to hear something. Amen. 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 Amen.
Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Somebody ought to say thank you. 